Hi everybody, this is uh, Fred at Fred Allotments, Fred Wallingham. Just thought I'd give you a little uh, allotment update. Right. Now what I've done, I've put onions in this one. Uh, Japanese onions, Japanese onions in that one. And uh, shallots in this one. Now people are saying, well what have you nest them for? Birds don't eat them. But what happens is the birds see those little shoots coming up, they think they're worms and they pull them out. So I've had to cover them up. Which would have pain up the bum, but it's done. Some lettuce here, and I've got to pick some as well. Right. So I've just put when you're on here and I've got that top, which had some uh, blood and bone, Romo and some chicken. So this is really good mug, so red onions are going in this one. Now I had an over, oh Bill's packed his allotment in, so he's giving me some uh, more strawberries. So what I've done, I've put them in here for now, but the better off wants them in a, a pot at home. So I'm just going to leave them in there for a while, and then bring the pots on here, fill them up, put them in, and then take them back to the house. So that's another job. <laughs> But they're coming on all right, these, uh, oh, these are my red onions, they're coming, what I've done, I've put them in little trays just for a change, I've not done them this way before, so I thought I'd give them a try and see what happens. And these are other strawberries, I think I've got enough here. I'm fancy making some jam this year. Right, let's have a look. It's, it's very windy, I must have. Can't be all grey, eh? Yeah, it's looking okay. And Bill has finally cleared all his pots. It's just about all gone now. So who's going to take it over? I don't know. So it's like I could have the hook, but I've already got one, so I don't want the hook. So I'll have to see what happens, won't we? Right. And what I'm doing down here, I'm covering this up for now to suppress the weeds, because this is all going to be fenced off. Uh, and chippings are going to go down, I think. Well, I've, I've got this fencing up here ready. I've got to get the boards to prolong it. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave a trough so long, along here, so I can put my tubs as spuds. So I've got to put a fence in here as well, about two foot wide. So, oh, my daughter's giving me some uh, shredded. <laughs> just to dry it up, I thought. Well, I've cleared the back here, so I need some more chippings as well. But there's plenty of scouts up, so that should be okay. Maybe just a quick update. I've not been here long. I just wanted to cover them uh, onions up. And I'm going to be planting my red onions probably next week sometime. And then my garlic. I don't know where I'm going to put the bloody garlic. I think it's going to go in the top one. I'll put the garlic in the top, I think, because he's not been doing a cabbage in there last year, so I'll put the garlic in. Beetroot. I can put early beetroot in, I don't know. Anyway, I love you and leave you. Thanks for uh, watching. And if you like what you see, subscribe, press that little old bell. And if you want any questions answered, please let me know. Right, bye for now. Bye.